Comma Nicate Correctly Mastering Commas and Clauses in English Hello learners! Today, we're diving deep into the world of English punctuation, focusing on how commas interact with clauses in your sentences. The correct usage of commas in English can change the meaning of your sentences. So, let's get started. In English, a clause is a part of a sentence that contains both a subject and a verb. Clauses can be either independent, able to stand on their own as complete sentences, or dependent, needing an independent clause to make sense. Let's take an example. I love reading, because it relaxes me. Here, I love reading, is an independent clause, and, because it relaxes me, is a dependent clause. When two independent clauses are connected in a sentence, they're usually separated by a comma and a conjunction. Conjunctions include words like, and, but, or, so, etc. Example, I love reading, and I also enjoy writing. In this sentence, I love reading, and, I also enjoy writing, are both independent clauses, so a comma is needed before the conjunction, and. When we're dealing with dependent clauses, the usage of commas depends on where the clause is in the sentence. If the dependent clause comes before the independent clause, use a comma. Because it was raining, I brought my umbrella. If the dependent clause comes after the independent clause, usually, we don't use a comma. I brought my umbrella because it was raining. However, if the sentence can be misunderstood without a comma, or if the dependent clause is not closely related to the rest of the sentence, a comma might be needed. I brought my umbrella, although the rain had stopped. Remember, we don't use commas to connect two independent clauses without a conjunction. Doing so leads to a common mistake called a comma splice. Example of a comma splice. I love reading, I also enjoy writing. Corrected version. I love reading, and I also enjoy writing. Well, that brings us to the end of this exciting journey through commas and clauses in English. Now, you should be better equipped to navigate this important aspect of grammar. Remember, the right punctuation can make all the difference in the world. Keep practicing, and you'll master these rules in no time. Happy learning!